Okay, so I'm, I've chosen um, six different coordinating um, pieces of card, paper, scrapbook paper. And what I'm going to do now is um, decorate the front of each of the boxes. So I'll pick the, the one that I might want to start with, which is going to be this one. Um, and then I want to decorate these, this small box. So what I do is I put the paper face down on the, on the board and then you can either use a sharp pencil and draw around the box. So just making sure it's all lined up correctly and draw around it. And then using the ruler and the craft knife, you can then um, cut that out. making sure to um, stay right to the edge of the, of the ruler um, and you want to have a metal ruler because this is the best way to, um, to cut with a craft knife. Okay, so you have your little, little square. Um, then what you want to do is you want to um, line it up on the front and then feel for where the, the knob is. And then with your pencil, you want to just mark where the centre of that is. Just look at it straight on, mark where the centre of it is. It doesn't need to be exact, just to get, get a, um, an idea. Um, and then you'll draw a circle, which is just a bit smaller than the, than the knob around your, um, around your dot. And then using your ruler again, from the dot, from the spot that you've drawn, down to the edge of the card, you draw a line. Okay, so you can see, it looks a bit like this. Okay, so then using your craft knife again, you carefully cut the circle out. Okay, and then using the ruler again, you can use the craft knife to cut down the line. Okay. Now you can see you've got a little, um, a little front of your box cover. So then you purely just slide this down over the, over the knob. So, um, you can actually see a little bit of a pencil line just down the front there. So um, it's probably better if you can get away without drawing the line down, it's, it's probably better. So then from here, you get your, um, your glue. So you get your glue and your, um, your paintbrush and you take it off. And then you using um, just a, a plain piece of paper to rest on so you don't you can actually just paint onto the directly onto the onto the box. Just make sure that the glue isn't too thick, and um, but you want it to be thick enough that it stays wet while you while you readjust it. Okay, and just make sure that drawing is close together and then just push it and make sure it's all, all flat out, flattened out. Okay, there you go. There's one box, one box done. Okay, so we'll carry on and do, do some others. therapeutic to do this. It's a nice um, activity to do on your own when you've got no one around or you want to get the kids involved. It's, it's pretty easy to then to do this, this bit like painting with the glue on the front of the box or um, even choosing the paper, whatever they want to do. Alright, there you go. So stick that onto the front. So 
make sure it's all fully pressed down so that it doesn't peel back. There we go. Number two done. Okay, so we'll just carry on like that and finish off the, the remaining drawers and yeah.